Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, to your Lord in the name of Jesus. You are he who was, who is, and who is to come. You are the Alpha and the Omega. You are the beginning and the end. You are the one true and living God. And we just want to glorify you on today, God, as being a soul source and the very essence of our being. Lord, we want to open up our hearts and our minds right now, Lord, in the name of Jesus. That we don't want to be distracted. We don't want to be consumed. We don't want to worry about what nobody else is doing, how they doing it. Oh, God, but we want to concentrate on you. We want to give you our best praise and our best worship because you are worth duty. You are worthy of it, God. But the only way that we could do it, Lord, is if we empty ourselves out. Huh? The only way we could do it, God, is if we cast all our cares at your feet. Because we know that you care for us, God. Huh? Oh, God, we cannot need your son in la casilla. Huh? We cannot need your son in la casilla. Huh? We cannot control a thing, God. Huh? We cannot control a person, God. Huh? We cannot make nobody your son in la casilla. Huh? But what we can do, God, huh, is lay these cares down at your feet. Huh? Because we know, God, in your casilla, huh, that you is all sovereign huh? and that you are all powerful huh? and that you are the only one. God, huh, that can handle a thing or take care of a thing. Huh? You are the one, Father God, huh, that can remove some things out of the hearts of the people. Huh? You are the one, God, huh, that can cease the thoughts of your people, God. Huh? It is you, God, huh, and it's not nothing that we can obtain on our own, huh, because you are the one, Father God, that is our great creator. Huh? You are the one, Father God, that be our God. It is you, God, huh? and not nobody else. Huh? So we just want to glorify you and lift you up. Huh? We want to give you our best praise and our best worship. Huh? We don't want to be modest. Huh? We don't want to be complacent. Huh? We do not want to your Ocosia. Huh? Allow any rocks to cry for us. Huh? But we want to give you all the salutations, huh? all the glory, huh? and all the honor. Huh? Because you're worthy, God. Huh? You're worthy, God. Huh? You're worthy. You worthy God, and there is nobody else, Father God, that can do it but you, God. And if you don't do it, it simply cannot be done. Oh God, I'm asking you to touch the hearts of your people on tonight, Father God, in the name of Jesus. You know any and everything is down in the inside of their hearts, God. You know all the bitterness and hate. You know all the jealousy and enviousness. You know all the stuff, Father God, that causes them to be distracted and discombobulated, God. So I'm asking you to remove it on tonight, God. I'm asking you to remove any and everything out of our hearts that's not like you, God. Remove any jealousy, enviousness, backbiting, tailbearing, covenant, slavishness, maliciousness, debate, hate, any bitterness, fornication, masturbation, any vain thing, a foul thing, a perverted thing. Huh? Remove any hateful thing, a point out thing, or even wagging our heads, God. Huh? Remove that competitive spirit, and even comparing the way you see. Huh? Remove that heresy, Father God, in the name of Jesus, or even seditious in the search. Huh? I'm asking you to remove the schisms and the isms. Huh? Remove any division, God. Huh? Remove these seeds, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that we may come together collectively, Father God, and build up your kingdom. Huh? Because it's not about us as an individual, huh? but it's simply about you, Father God. God as a whole. Huh? And we want to lift you up and glorify you, God. Huh? But we can't do it if we're distracted. Huh? We can't do it if we're consumed. Huh? We can't do it if we're troubled. Huh? We can't do it if we got a strain on our brain. Huh? We can't do it, Father God, in the name of Jesus, if we keep doing what we want to do, huh? how we want to do it, huh? and when we want to do it. So I'm asking you, Father God, in the name of Jesus, give the people the heart of you, God. Give them a heart to 
rewards you, God. Huh? Give them a heart to love you, Lord. Huh? Give them a heart to be diligent, God. Huh? Give them a heart of considering, God. Huh? Give them a heart of love on tonight, God. Huh? I'm standing in the gap for your people, Father God, in every nation, huh? every tongue, huh? every religion, huh? every nationality. Huh? I'm standing in the gap right now, Father God, in the name of Jesus, because I know without a shadow of a doubt that you can handle it. Huh? I know without a shadow of a doubt you can fix it. Huh? I know without a shadow of a doubt, Father God, that you make all things well. Huh? So right now, Father God, in the name of Jesus, I'm casting my cares at your feet, Father God, huh? concerning your people. Huh? You said, come on, you that labor and I heavy laden, you will give us rest. Huh? So I'm expecting rest in you, Father God, huh? concerning that situation, God, huh? of that evil one, huh? concerning that secret what you are going to see, huh? of that wicked one, huh? concerning that situation, Father God, in the name of Jesus, he come in the see, huh? Oh, God, I'm asking you to help on today, God. Remove any and every discrepancy out of our hearts on today, Lord. Because if you do not remove these things out of our hearts, Father God, in the name of Jesus, we will continue, Lord, to walk around and be bitter. We'll continue to walk around and be just who we are. Sever that spirit of depravity on tonight, God. Sever that spirit, Father God, of accusation. Sever that lying demon on tonight, God. Help us to be more honest towards you, towards one another, and even towards our own selves. Help us on today, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that your will will be done and performed in our lives, God, in the right time, and in the course, according to your purpose and your plan, and not our own. Help us not to be so selfish and greedy, Father God, in the name of Jesus, only worrying about our own selves, and wishing evil and wicked to ready or proceed towards one another. Help us on today and remove these things on today, Father God. Help us on today, Father God, not to give you or see, just to accept your love, God. But help us out to give love. Help us out to receive love. Help us out to love the right way, Lord, the way that you designed us to, Father God. And not the way that we were taught of what we think. Because it's just not right. Help us on today, Father God, not to be mediocre, shocked in like I see. To be so vengeful. And they get back spirit. And you are called shocked in like I see. Help us to turn on today, Father God. And regulate our minds, Father God, that our thoughts will not be so even wicked towards one another. That our thoughts, Father God, in the day of the Lord, see, he can't let it It's not towards sabotaging somebody in their growth. Naturally, as well as spiritually. And help us not to even sabotage our own growth. Naturally, as well as spiritually. Help us on today, Father God, in the name of Jesus, to be at peace with one another. Help us to have some self-control, Father God. It's so quick for us to get angry and defensive, Father God. And then we go into a place of rage and wrath. I'm asking you to remove it on today, Father God, and decipher it from our hearts on today, God. Circumcise our hearts and give us a heart of flesh. Remove the hardness of the heart. Remove the stony heart. Oh God, he can't let the loco shot that it like I see. The only way, Father God, the can't shot that the loco see. We're asking you for your help on today, Father God. Serve them old times and them soul times, Lord, that continually keep coming up in our thoughts, God, that continually keep us going to the Ocosia, around in a cycle, running around in a circle, like a dog or a cat chasing his tail. Help us on tonight, Father God, in the name of Jesus, not to continue to be Akashandere Akashia. Help us on today, Lord, to consider and even reconsider our ways and our actions towards you. Write your words upon the tables of our heart and bottom them about our neck and stir them up in the very bowels of our belly. Oh, God, I'm asking you to help us on today, God. Give us that praying spirit. We always have excuses, Father God, why we don't want to pray. We always have excuses, Father God, why we can't pray. But, Lord, you said we also always pray and not the faint. You said we ought to pray without ceasing. So give us that praying spirit, Father God. That your spirit, Lord, in the name of Jesus, will help us, Father God, to be spiritual and not religious. Help us on today, Father God, in the name of Jesus, and remove the mask, God. Remove that chameleon. And suit uh, and that sense of pretense. Uh, help us on today, Father God, to get in a hurry. Uh, help us get serious about our souls. Uh, help us on tonight, Father God, and give us a heart of absolutions and even forgiveness, Lord, uh, that we will not continue to walk around and be grudging. Uh, oh God, we need your help. Uh, we need you on today, Father God, to serve that spirit of pride and haughtiness on today. Uh, remove that dainty spirit, God. Uh, remove that self-righteous spirit. Uh, and that speedy of God, Sunday the local sea. Uh, help us on today, Father God. God, in the name of Jesus, to have enough courage to take accountability, to take accountability for our own thoughts, our own actions. Help us to acknowledge these things, Father God, as well as acknowledging you as being the sole source and the very essence of our being, Lord. Help us out today.
mandate, Father God, to simply do that thing right in you, God. You say we ought to seek you first, your kingdom and your righteousness, and all else will be added. Help your people not to be so cool, so, cool, so consumed. With the cares of this world and this life, Father God, that they forget that your daily old go see that they help comes from you. Huh? Help your people on today, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Huh? Not to think and believe, Father God, that they gotta compete to be seen. Huh? Not to think and believe that they gotta be competing or something see competitive with one another. Huh? Because we all need one another. Huh? And we show sure all need Jesus. Huh? So help us on tonight, Father God. Huh? Help us right now, Father God, and I go shot it like I see, uh, to keep our hands clean, uh, to walk upright, uh, holy, uh, and circumspect, uh, doing what you tell us to do. Uh, help us on today, Father God, uh, to follow your instructions that we may be free. Uh, help us on today, Father God, uh, to follow your direction that we may be whole. Uh, help us on today, Father God, uh, to submit ourselves under your mighty hand, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that you may be able to be of uh, course, guide us, uh, and lead us, uh, and strengthen us, uh, and Help us, Father God. Help us on tonight, Father God. We need your help on today that you may remove that spirit of disobedience. Remove that spirit of rebellion. Remove that spirit of fear. Remove that spirit of hesitation. Remove that perverted spirit of your word. Remove that perverted spirit sexually. Remove that perverted spirit in conversation. Remove any and all perversion, Father God, that causes us to err and even cause your people to err. I'm asking you to help us, Lord, to put our thoughts on the subjection. Help us, Lord, to put our flesh on the subjection. Help us, Lord, to put our speech on the subjection, Lord. Because you said in your word that salt and pepper can be all go see. Hold my mind, it all go see. Our sweet and sour cannot come out of the same way. Help us on today, Father God. That we will not curse others as well as cursing our own selves, Lord. Sever that spirit, Father God, in the name of Jesus, the degradation and even segregation. Oh, God, let your people know, Father God, that we are all worthy. And you take all of us in high regard, Lord. That you passionately love each and every last one of us individually. And we don't have to be jealous of one another. We do not have to compete with one another. We do not have to think we can be evil towards one another because of the favor that you have placed on our lives. Oh, God, because if we line up with your will and with your way and with your purpose, you will show them favor as well. Help us on today, God, to know that you have no respect of person and that these things are available for all of us, Father God. Help us on today, Father God, to accept the season that we are in. Help us on today, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that we will even consider reproach out the old man and not keep doing the same thing, not keep acting the same way, not keep the Oko Shaknere like I see. Oh God, I'm at the Oko Shaknere like I see. Help me, Oko Shaknere like I see. Oh God, because because you know, God, you know any and everything that we struggle with. You know any and everything that's a reality of a struggle. You know any and everything, Father God, that causes us to be up all in the night, the old cold sea, the wee hours of the night. I'm asking you to give me some sweet sleep. Give your people some sweet sleep. Let your people cast their cares on you because they know that you care for them, God. Remove any doubt, any compromise, and any hesitation. Help your people up to their God. Oh, God. Help your people on today, Lord, in the name of Jesus. He come to the local sea. Overturn some things in their hearts, God. Meet your people here, go sun in the local shun in my mind in the local sea. Meet he can't in the local sea. I hear the local shun in the local sea. Oh, God, he a call shun in me. Call to key on the money. I can see. Oh, my money. I can share the mind in the local sea. The selfishness and the stinginess, God. He a call shun in the local sea. Oh, Baba, say you'll call me a cashina. Oh, God, cover us. Keep us. Take away that. Let us be real about your God. Let us be true about your God. Let us be diligent towards you. Let us be consistent in you. Help us. Oh God, in the Oh God, don't let these things be your Whatever your will and whatever your purpose is, God. 
Let your people consider, Father God, that they won't wait till they get on their backs, God, or something drastic happen to them, and then they want to submit. Let them submit beforehand so when that thing come upon them, God, it won't be so hard for them to accept it because they know that you are with them, and this too shall pass. Oh, God, complete the work that you've begun in your people, God. Let them not faint and get weary, and if by chance they turn and walk away from you, don't even want me, I can see, it's not the way I go shine it like I see. Uh -huh. Oh God. Because you know the hearts of your people. You know the hearts and even the minds of your people, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Because they're not walking away from me, they're walking away from you. You know, go see. Take your people out of that stupid state. Out of that state, Father God, of thinking and believing that they got it together because you said in your word that if we trust in our own heart, we become fools. You said in your word, Father God, in the name of Jesus, he come to go see that the heart is deceitful and desperately wicked above all things who can do it. We don't even know, oh, Mama, I need a local seat. And when you expose these things and let us know that these things is this need a local seat, uh -huh. let us take accountability and acknowledge it and face these things, Father God, in the name of Jesus, that you may help us, God, that we will not continue to practice these as Father God, that it's not pleasing in your sight because one thing for sure and for certain, I never want you to turn your back on me. And please, Lord, don't ever take your spirit away because without your spirit, I know I am doomed. Yeah. I realize that you are the sole source and the very essence of our being, the epitome of our creation and existence, Lord. And I just want to bless you all tonight, God. Give you all the glory, the honor, and the praise because you are worthy. There is nobody else that is like you now, then, and even to come. You are truly one of a kind. You are the best thing that could ever happen to me. <laughs> oh, God, when I start loving you, I made the best decision in my life. <laughs> when I turned and started walking with you, Lord, I knew my life was going to get better. And I need go see. I thank you for allowing me the opportunity to make the choice of a free will to simply say, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. You know what is best for me. You know what is best for me, God. It's not nobody else that can tell me what is best for me but you, God. And I accept your will. I accept you because you created me just for this you queen you go see you equip me god and i thank you
the gratitude, Father God, you know, for the shadow of the Lord, God, and knowing that in the waiting, you always pay for it. Oh, God, you are a promise keeper. You are a way maker. And everything that you say is simply yes. And amen. And I thank you, Lord. I thank you for today, my body, your coffee, and I'm not even a little coffee, even for what's to come. I thank you for what's to come, no, I didn't call it a little coffee. What the doctor says is not a coffee. I didn't call it a little coffee. Thank you, Lord. Can you say thank you, man? I am not a little coffee. Oh, yeah, but I need you, Lord. Thank you, God, for what you do. Oh, God, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. He's gone before me. He is so gracious, God. I can never be. Thank you, Mr. Gracious. Thank you, Mr. Gracious. Thank you, Mr. Gracious. Thank you, Mr. Gracious. Thank you for your love, God. Thank you, Lord. For me, you're going to see a little hope. A little hope. Oh, God, I thank you. 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 Oh, God, that I would be your coach and your love. You know it all. Thank you, Lord. For the new year. You see it all. Thank you, Lord. You know it all. You know it all. You know it all. You know it all. Thank you. I don't believe it all. I don't believe it all. But what I do know, I need it all. I need it all. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your forgiveness, God. Oh, God. I thank you, Lord. 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 I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you for the Lord, God. I thank you for the Holy Spirit. I thank you, Lord, for the Holy Thank you, Jesus. 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 For the grounding, for the root, for the stability, for the anger. Thank you, Father God. I can be reminded of all things. Thank you, Jesus. You are worthy, God. You are worthy, God. Everything that is in your power, everything you 